Oh boy. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a, a super early live streaming here. Sorry for being late. Uh, it's a little bit too early for me. Oh my goodness. Who changed the goddamn timing for the... I have to wake up at like 6 a.m. here. So like 5 to 8. Uh, again, uh, I am apologize. Uh, I apologize for being late. Uh, it's a little... It's a little, little too early for me. I, I just woke up here. Um, you know? But uh, we'll see. We'll see what we're gonna have today, yeah? Uh, let me try to bring up some music here. Mm, CD. OBS music. New copyright. And some music for you guys here. We got some. Mm, 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 mm. So we got test out some. We got test out a manitor today, okay, guys? Um, let me try here. Give me one second. Give me one second here uh, to test it out. Uh, We s we're not lit. We're not lit. Nobody going inside yet. Uh, nobody inside yet. Yet. So we okay. We can get there. Uh, just have to prepare here a little bit. Oh my god! I am so sleepy right now. So sleepy. So sleepy right now. I'll get equipment on my um a manitor uh, Artemisius. I'm using her primary for, for now. So let's switch out the equipment on my YSC here. Switch it out. And put it on my Artemisia's here. Uh, Richer. Fair enough, fair enough. Uh, and I'm gonna use a 25% army expansion only. Um, so I wouldn't be using Art Artemisia's a lot because I don't have a lot of T4 for Art. And I am trying to save go. I am trying to save go for... For... Zenith power event, okay guys, so I'm gonna try to use them a little bit, okay uh, A little bit only All right, Not a lot because I do not have a lot of T4 here, All right, using T5 is going to cost me a lot of gold So just go use uh, for this one uh, uh, Let's put on, oh, uh, oh shoot, my grand does not have the lucky coin Hello. I didn't change my gear on my grand. Oh shit, my grand has no gear. Almost fucked up. <laughs> Almost messed up there, guys. Hey, hey, xin chào mọi người. Hey, welcome to the stream, guys. Uh, give me a couple minutes here. C give me a couple minutes to prepare my marches to the gate, guys. Uh, I, I, I got up a little bit late here. Um, so let me try to um, prepare a little bit here, okay, guys? Just give me a couple minutes here. Let's use this one. Strap out. Uh, go use it on my Alex and Hero. Alex and Hero Summer. Or oh, Alex YG. Uh, let's you let let's go with Alex YG. Let's go with Alex YG here. Uh what skill? What skill for Alex and YG? Uh, I might have messed up my skill set here. I might have messed up my skill set here. Uh, attack. No, use this one. Let's use this skill here. 
And... Four. 269,000. I got my gear. Got my gear on my Alex. Yeah, I got my gear on my Alex here. And I, I need to sit my, my gear on my Gwen. I do not have gear on my Gwen. The hell? Uh, I use the equipment on my Gwen here. And use another weapon here. And let's switch. Where is my where's the gear on my freaking Gwen? Let's switch this one. Uh, let's bring Gwen and Leo out here. Oh, is it coming in? No, no, wait for me! Wait for me! Wait for me. Gwen Leo. And we can definitely try to use uh, we can definitely try to use Charm Mattel and YSC as well. Charm Mattel and Hero. Uh, you gotta fix up some gear here on them. Add this one. Uh, add this one here. Okay. Okay, okay. Let's go with Gwen and Hero, uh, Charm Mattel and Hero here, guys. And what skill can I use? Oh my god, I have no skill. Oh, I, I can use this skill here on my uh, on my Trauma Town Hero here. Uh. Okay, let's go inside. We are pushing in. We are in here. Uh, I think my uh, my Artemia is in here first, so let's get my Artemia inside first. Uh, let's check on the enemy zone here. How are they doing? Uh, the enemy is still at the gate here. They are not inside yet. Whoa! Whoa! 1601 is inside first? What? They're early! They're inside early and we're late? Uh, no way. We're late, guy. We led to the altar here, so we're giving them some uh, head start here, okay? We're giving, we're giving the enemy some head start here. Uh, how is our uh, our allies doing here on this side? Uh, our allies coming in, but uh, look like look like 1534 is at our allies gate here. Uh, our allies cannot come out. Uh, our allies cannot pushing out here. Um. Let's check out the, the, the other altar, the mutual one, the one with no fighting. Uh, look like 2056 is gang that altar here. It does look like 2056 is gang that altar. How about that one here? Ooh, look at it. Look at 1601 is not here. Yo, 1601 is all in. 1601 is, um, 1601 is all here. Oh, oh, let me try something else. As well, let me try something new here. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna add in. Um, I'm going to add in the, the 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 filter. Can you guys see the marker? Is it helping with like hiding the hiding the marker? Oh. Uh, I can I can hide some of the marker here, right? Like the one with the follow the marker lady is. I'm not able to see it. Uh, you guys can still see it. Uh, but some of the other one, uh, you, I can hide. I can hide the marker. I can hide the marker for some of the other one. Oh, my marches is in here at last. Finally, let's go. Uh, only twenty five percent army expansion. Only twenty five percent army expansion here. Uh, look like sixteen oh one is making a big murder boy here. They are making a big murder boy at the choke boy here. Ah, uh, boy, let's go. Let's go, 1601. Oh my god, my eye. Ah. Let me drink some coffee here. Ah, yeah. That can definitely help me out. That can definitely help me out there. 
Here go my Artemis here. Hopefully, so today I had to play very, very careful. Uh, I don't want to get hit a lot. I don't want to get hit by a lot. Uh, because I want to save my resource and speed up for... <laughs> I want to save my spe resource and speed up for Xenia power. So I want to use T4 mostly and I don't I don't wanna, I don't want to get swarm. I do not want to get swarm today. The most important thing is to not gain swarm today, especially with using archer. Uh so the the equipment I'm using on my archer are mostly um providing defense and survivability. A flame threat here giving 7.5% health. Uh, ancient strategy, I'm giving that actual 3% troop capacity. Uh, the revival grief, giving that archer defense seven, net ten percent more defense there. The weapon is something I really, really like about archer equipment. Is the weapon gave very, very high amount of defense, seventeen percent defense here. Uh, the glove gives some some kind of attack here, six percent attack. I'm trying to utilize the set as well so that I can get that um. Uh, three percent defense bonus for the four set piece bonuses. Uh, that's what I'm trying for going for. So three percent defense. Uh, I might changing up a little bit with my future set. I might go for, I might go for the the other the other piece of uh, legging instead. Uh, for my future, I'm I might get I might get another archer march, and I might get a different piece of equipment. I might. I might. Uh, I think there are two like two other pieces of equipment that give you more defense, right? For Archer. Um I could have go for that one. Right? I could have go for I could have go for that one right here. Uh Archer Defense. No, not this one. I could go for this one. This one gave Archer Defense eight percent. And they another chat piece that gave Archer Defense. Uh I can go for the legendary. I could go for the legendary chest as well. I could go for the legendary chest. Um or I could just stick with the the, the blue one. Right? I could stick with the blue one, Archer Hell 6% and go with the legging here. That that might be my future one, my future piece. I'm not go I'm not I'm not gonna go for the four piece set bonuses for the revival the revival set. Uh, the revival set gave like four piece set bonus, right? But I might go for my future archer commander. I might go for like only two piece, uh, two piece set bonuses, and I'm gonna go for the two other, two other one. Uh, that gave more defense and health. Okay, we're going in. Let's go. Uh, let's hope we don't get target today, and we can get a lot of kills. Uh, Artemis and Humanitor here. Uh, my Artemis and Humanitor is not expertise. Uh, my Artemis is 5534 five, only. And my Omanitor is only 5411, guys. Okay. So not super crazy strong. Not super, super crazy strong, but we'll use, we'll use what we can. Uh, we'll see how some of the report looking today are for them. And we'll decide uh, are they good or not. We got Alex here, we got uh, Gwen is here, we got Charm Mattel coming in. We can switch them out. Uh, we can switch in and out these marches there to get to help us with some more kill. Woo! The lag. How's the lag looking here? We got someone. We got First Blood. We not Lugaji. Lugaji is the first one to die. Hey, wait up, wait up, wait up. Wait up, wait up, boys. Remind me tomorrow. Let's go for that salad then. Let's go for the one that close to me. Let's go for go for the grand here. Oh. We are destroying the murder bar here, boy. Let's stay on the richer here. Or oh, Zit Gwan. Let's stay on Zit Gwan instead. He's a little closer. Damn, everything died. 
Everything dies so fast. Oh my god. Everything dies so fast here. Uh, go back here. It's like we are just wiping them out here. It's like all the sad fits going back from 1601. Like seriously. Seriously 1601. Like all the sad fits going back like. I barely, I barely see any sad face going back from, uh, from 1860. Like, all the sad face going back from 1601 here. What the heck? Like, why all the sad face going back from 1601 here? Oh my goodness. What is, what is, what is all the sad face going back from 1601 here? Uh, let's go in. Let's push inside here. Like, I did not see a single sad face going back for 1860. Uh, I think it, it like, too one-sided here. It, it way, way too one-sided here, guys. Uh, 1601, they was here early, but they don't have enough player. It's like, it's like not even, it's not like a good resistance here. It's not like a good resistance here, boy. Yo, we just wiping them out. We just like completely wipe them out. Like, it's not even fun. I, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't consider it was fun. Uh, let's go. Let's get a little bit more aggressive here to get us some kill. It's like, oh my god. <laughs> we barely, we barely able to touch anybody there. Barely. Barely anybody. Oh my goodness. And I think everything's just gonna die here. Everything is just gonna die here. So fast and so quickly here. Uh, I got I gotta focus on my kill here. Otherwise, I'm not getting any kill here. Please give me some kills. Okay, so who's targeting me like for a minute walking here? Gotta relax. Gotta chill a little bit, okay, boy? Uh, this is not gonna be a good test for a Manitor. Because it's like too one sided here. We are winning by a lot. Like, it is too easy. Right? When you gain such an easy win like this one, you definitely gotta get like super positive cheer off here. Like right? super super positive cheer off here for us here. There is no way I am getting negative cheer off for anything here. No way. It's gonna be like a crazy crazy positive cheer off here for us. Oh my god, 1601 they did not show up today. 1601 they did not show up today guys. Ah. Uh... Like, did we even manage to get like a freaking? Did I did I even get like a hundred thousand kill from that? <laughs> from that? From that? From the altar here? Uh, so I don't think I get a hundred thousand kill. Uh, let's try to push up a little bit here. Being a little bit more aggressive here with the kill. Look like I did get swarm or something here. Look like I did get swam, I think. Who bring inside Ato Flat here? Who is using Ato Flat here? Jesus Christ. Oh my god, everything just died. Everything just died here. Everything just die. Give me some kill. Uh, 
Oh my god. It's like... It's like their market don't last more than like 10 seconds. Like by the time I target something, they just die already. Like this is not a very very good show by uh, 1601 here. Like they definitely do not have the number here to fight against us. I gotta go for this Richard here, he's a little far. Okay, let's go for him. Let's go for him, he's 4 HP. Gotta, gotta go for this 4 HP Richard here. Oh my god, he's died. Like the 4 HP Richard died just like that. Oh my god. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, uh. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, that was fun. That was fun, 1601. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, this is def definitely not what I expected here. Oh, uh, this is horrible. This is horrible for my content. Let's go after the Chon Motel here. He's he far outside. He outside. I can get some kill. Please let me hit on this guy here, Leo. Leo to me. Leo to me, please. Let me hit you. Let me hit, let me hit you up a little bit here, Leo. Oh, he died? Like Leo to me die already? Oh my god. Like, oh. If, is it even like a fight? Oh, shoot. Oh, maybe I should go back to sleep here. Maybe I should go back to sleep. Like, we gave them, we gave them like a head start, we gave them like a good positioning at the, at the center, but uh, they've not been trying. Uh, my army expansion, what a waste! I wasted my army expansion, guys. Oh my god, what to do here? Uh, we can look at some of the report for... And look at some of the report for Artemis here. Hey, positive report, 100% guarantee. What? I got swum? The Attila killer was on me. That's why. That Attila killer was on me. Even though it's say one minute away. What the heck? Uh, talking about positive trade off here. Trying to get some positive trade off here, but uh, doesn't seem like good enough. Grand coming out. Uh, hey, it's such a boring. It's like a boring. Um, it's like such a boring altar here. Oh my god! I thought I thought you know one is gonna give it hundred percent. Oh my god! I woke up early for nothing. I woke up early for nothing here. Uh, like why are we fucking? Why are we on this side? Like why the game positioning us like this here? Like why the fuck did Lilith put like two of the strongest uh, cam uh, opposite of each other here? This is so bullshit. How are uh, how are fifteen thirty four doing without allies here? I think fifteen thirty four they have an easy time without ally as well. Like our allies got pushed back to the gate as well here. And uh, like 1534 don't even have that many players. Uh, boring. Uh, sorry guys. Uh, this is not even good. Holy shit. We got 70 people online to see this. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, this is not, uh, <laughs> I woke up early for the fucking nothing. Like, I woke up, I woke up early for, like, two minutes of fighting. Two minutes of fighting. We just, we just, we just wipe them out. We just wipe them out at the altar. Uh, this is not even funny. I, I, <laughs> I set my alarms up.
My stream is bugging? How bugging? Uh, I I'm trying to use some... Uh, I'm trying to hiding uh, the, the, the marker. That's why. Sorry, guy. Oh, no need to hide the marker now. I'm trying to use something. Okay, I'm testing something today so that... Uh, when King's Land open, I can I can run the first the first ten minutes with that with the with the texture hiding so that I can hide the marker. Uh, I can undo it now because there is no marker now. <laughs> uh, I was testing it a little bit, right? I'm trying to hide the markers uh, when uh, when King's Land and the, and when the level seven gate open. Is it hard to see? Is it hard to see with that texture issue or no? Right. Otherwise, I had to stream on my on my other cow, right? For example, right here, you can see I right, reach the marker, fall back from the past, right? If I turn on the marker, right? If I turn on the filter, uh, you probably you probably not gonna be able to see the marker here, right? Can you see the marker now, right? But you won't be able to see what it say in the marker, right? But like the texture is a little bit weird, a little bit, right? It, it, it's a little bit weird. Uh, I wanna use it one when like King's Land open, right? When King's Land open, when uh, when the level seven get open a little bit. So that they cannot tell like what it say in the marker here, right? Uh, so that I can I don't reveal I don't reveal the marker, but I know I know it, it it's kind of like a little bit glitchy with the with the texture a little bit. Is it okay or not? I I, I need you guys feedback here, right? For example, this one right here, right? Uh, you cannot see what the marker is saying, right? Uh, but I turn but I but I uh, but if I turn uh, turn off the the filter, uh, you can see the marker. You can see what the marker is saying, right? Uh, so what that is what I was planning to use. Uh, is it too hard? Is it too hard to see me fighting or, or no? Uh, I can use it for the first 20 minutes, 30 minutes when some of the important event happens. So I don't reveal the marker for my alliance. And at the same time, I can just play on my on my main account without without worrying about too much about like, oh, someone can fucking see the marker and whatnot, right? Uh, that is what I'm trying to do. Uh, let me return my let me return my Artemis here and bring in my Gwen. Oh, that was a that was a horrible horrible altar fight. Uh, coming from 1601, uh, I would expect a little bit more, a little bit more resistant, you know, a little bit more resistant here. Especially today is what Sunday, right? Sunday is fun day. Sunday is fun day, guys. Uh. <laughs> Like we pulling, like we we pulling back, we we are pulling back from the gate, but like people are people at the gate, people are trying to get the kill in here. Yeah. People are trying to get the kill in from the gate here, guys. Oh my god! Uh, let me say something in the locking up chat here. <laughs> uh 25% army expansion wasted 25% army expansion did you guys do you guys did you guys see the did you guys see the fire at at the choke point right you guys call the fire the choke point right it's like every single march it dead was from 1601 right we did not have any march it die there right everyone everyone from 1601 just died like flyers oh my god uh, the murder ball was not very effective, is what I had to say. <laughs> uh, oh my god, let's see how many kills we get so far today. Uh, look, let, let's look at some of the report here. We got 101, okay, 101, we got 55. Oh my god, I got killed here, I got hit. Uh, 55, 55 here, A and I, is that 100, 100 kills? 100 kills for today. 170 here is at a 200 kill, 250 kills. <laughs> 5,000, okay, this one was pretty, I got 5,000 kill here. 927, 1,400 here is good, good. 469 here, good, good. How about this one here? Uh, paying attention on your resources for Zenith Town. Yes, that is why I'm trying to use D4. And, but hey, it doesn't look like I, I, I had to do a lot of fighting here. Uh, a thousand kill here, right? Positive shoot up here, but hey, it doesn't reflect. It doesn't reflect a lot because, like, 
there was not actual resistance from the enemy here right a lot of the fire here are just like positive shut up for me because the enemy they were not resisting right we were just destroying them there uh but so far uh the report was not that super amazing uh, the report was not that super amazing. One thing is that my Omanitor is not expertise. So I just show you guys here. My Omanitor is 5411 only. And my Artemia is 5534. Which is not super crazy. 5000 to 12000 here. 1.4 to 3.5. Not that super crazy. I, I, I want to see some more like strong resistance fighting. All right, so I'm going to use I'm gonna use Artemia's and Omanitor when the level 7 get open. Uh, to see them how that how they perform in the open field as well but as of right now they doing okay uh, everything died just so quickly we couldn't do shit uh, the game crash on me here uh the game crashing on me here it's uh it oh i think kingsland kingsland opened today for 1307 right since we're here we might be able to go and check out 1307 a little bit to see how they are doing um Unfortunately, unless unless you know one, they go they go doing some like major pushing out here. I just don't see much fighting happening here uh, at the altar. I I can tell that a lot of people in uh, 1860. Uh, I think a lot of people in 1860 are very disappointed right now. I would say. I think a lot a lot of us are very disappointed uh, with with the altar. I, I would say I I would say the same thing happened for 1534 as well, I think. Uh I, I think the same thing I, I, I can say I can say the same thing for 1534. Uh okay, okay, they got some magic coming back here. Okay, okay. Maybe maybe we still gonna have some fighting happening, maybe. It's a maybe for now, but uh I just don't see some uh I, I just don't see 1601 can do anything with this many player here. Uh maybe. Maybe uh maybe they can manage a pushback here, maybe, but I I honestly don't see the number. I honestly don't see the number here from 1601. Like we can just like easily wipe the thing wipe the guy out again. Easily. Uh How do you play on PC? Uh, you use BlueStack, guys. Uh, I could make out E and H. What E is an H? Oh, you talking about the market? Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys could still see the marker? Is it not good? Like, I, I turn off the marker. I, I turn off the filter now, guys. Oh. But I, I might try to play a little bit more with the filter so that I can hide the marker for my alliance. But it does it does affect the texture for the game. It does affect the texture for the game. What do you guys think? Is it a good idea to play with the filter on or is it better for me to stream from the another account and play on my So I could I could stream on my farm account and then I can use my iPad to play on my main account for like a first 20 minutes or something. Uh to avoid showing the marker. Uh, for like for like future streaming, right? Uh, I definitely do not want to reveal any kind of like strategic planning for 1860. Uh, so that is that that what I've been trying to play around with my setting here for like streaming. Uh, like if I'm gonna play on my main account with the filter on, uh, you probably gonna have to see some like weird stuff, right? Some weird texture here and there because it's because of the filtering. Uh, nothing perfect. There is no way. There is no way I can just like hide the marker here. Uh, there is that 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 is that is not an option, unless unless Lilith, unless Lilith can uh, can add like can can like have an an option to like hey, uh, do not show the marker or some shit. Uh, is there even an an option to turn off the marker? Right? Maybe, maybe Lilith can add an uh, add an option to to hide the marker. Maybe. Okay, 1601 is coming back. 1601 is coming back, guys. Let's go. Uh, the altar is open in about 20 minutes here. Wait, 25 minutes. We got the altar opening. Uh, hey, wait, 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 wait. Where's my guard coming? 
with my one gum boys like they have about i would say like 30 marches here like about 30 marches here we we make a big push and we gotta kick them kick their ass again like they need to have a better they need to have better turnout here right they need to have more they need to have more number pretty much uh let's fight Go for this bad boy. Go for this bad boy. Going for all for the bad boy here. Someone is using YSG as primary here. Ooh, Ethel Flat primary. Let me cast a skill, please, boys. Let me cast a skill here. Ooh, look at that one. Look at that one, boy. Don't let him go home. Go for this guy. We go for this guy instead. He's closer. He's going a little bit closer here. So let's go for him. Don't swarm me, please. I'm innocent. Go for this Gwen. Or is it uh go for this Sadden? Let's go for that Sadden instead there. He's a little far. He's a little far out. He's a little far out and chase after him. And after that I can go after the uh, XY. Or is it Richard and Atto flat right here? We definitely go after that Richard and Atto flat. He's right here! Oh my god, everything died. Everything dying here today. Everything dying. I guess I could use this one. Uh, since there are like not many marches here, I could use this one. I could use this one for more kill. Go for that guy. Maybe that's gonna be easier here in terms of getting killed. Yes. Let's do this. Let's use that strategy here for using the dot. Since there are not many marches here to target, I think uh, using this strategy is much better here. Right? Uh, we can definitely see uh, marches a lot easier here. Right, seeing the dot right here. Uh, getting easier kill here. Like everything just die. Everything just freaking die. I swear to God. Everything just die like, like crazy here. Dropping like fly. Right? I target on something for like a minute. Right, going after that guy. Going after that dot wise here. And go after this guy right here. Let's go after that guy. Let's zoom in and zoom out. Zoom in and out a little bit here. When you're when on some target, we can zoom in and out. Okay, that target it die. Go back here. Okay, I think this one is good. I think I think fighting with the I think fight, fighting with the dot is very very good when you're using a single marches. Uh, you can definitely know where your marches is. 
and you can position yourself very very well i would say uh i can i can position myself very very well here who is this guy here who is the guy going here is it a tear the killer alex we are on we are on the alex here we are on the alex here boy Go here. Maybe I should have used it from the start. Let's go for this guy. We just have to be able to pick on the target here. There are too many blue marches right now. Wait, too many blue marches here. I can I cannot see. I cannot see where the target is from not from uh from using a zoom in. So I need to select a target first and then I can zoom in, okay? Select a select the first target and then zoom in, okay guys? For example, this one right here. Or, I can go on this side here. Why right? is there like a two marches here? Is there like a two marches here? I can select some uh, some of the dot here. Select this guy. He's a little outside. Don't die yet yet. Don't die on me. Don't die on me yet yet. Oh my god, don't die. Oh my god, everything died when they come out. Okay, I got this one. I got I got a target. I got a target boys. I got the I got the bearber. I got the bearber and chow chow. Can I get something else? Oh my god. Everything just go to hell. We just we just destroy everything here. Like everything come out for like five minutes and uh we just destroy it. We just wreck. We just we just wreck everything coming out here. Everything come out from the gate, we just we just instantly like instant death. Instant death for everything coming out from the gate, guys. Oh my god. Are we are we going back? Are we pulling back? No. There is no marker saying for pulling back here. Uh but like usually usually I prefer to fight a zooming in, but like today we just like we just way way outnumber the, the enemy here. <laughs> like I can't even target I can't even target my, my own marches here. Like among all of the blue marches here. So, <laughs> uh, are we staying here? Are we staying here for some kill or what here? Let's stay here for some kill. With my Grand Leo here. Uh, waiting for the enemy to come out. This one is good. I like it. I like using I like using the dot to fight when uh, when I'm at the gate here. I can easily targeting on the target here easily, which is very very nice. Super super nice here. Anyone anyone else coming out? This guy, for example, he just came out. Go after that guy. Someone is attacking me here. Oh, he's dead. Someone is on me, but he's dead. Who is it coming out? Who is it coming out, boy? Oh, 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 they're pushing out. Don't swarm me, boy. Why are you guys swarming me here? You be nice to me. Give me a kill.
Right? We can, we can zoom in. We can zoom in when there are a lot of enemies there. We zoom in when there are a lot of enemies to target and we zoom out when there are not many. Okay, guys? That is the plan. The plan is to zoom in when... Oh, shit! Oh, 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 pull back, pull back, pull back, pull back, 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 Oh, shit, we're dying here. But be careful here, boys. Careful here, oh, we gotta die. Gotta be super, super careful here. Yo, don't target on me. I'm bailing out. I'm bailing out, boy. I'm bailing out. Oh shit, they're pushing back in. They're pushing back in, boy. Run, run, run. <laughs> we gotta regroup back to our to our to our uh, to our side here. Woo! Good thing I did get I did not get swam. Good thing I did not get swam there. Uh we, we gotta pull back here. Is the altar opening very soon? 13 minutes. Is someone on me? Who is chasing after my friend here? How dare you chasing after my friend? Who is this guy here? A chow chow chasing after me. A chow chow is chasing after us here. How dare them? How dare you chasing after us? Okay, run, 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 run. <laughs> uh, I gotta run back quickly here. Ooh! Ooh! Relax! Relax, boys! Ball up here. We're balling up there. Oh, who is this guy here? Who is this guy keep chasing after me here? Gotta chill a little bit. Gotta chill a little chill a little bit here. Who is infamous here? Who is infamous? Who is on me? The heck? Okay, gotta gotta play with zoom I'm zooming out here. Let's go for easy target, boys. Let's go for the easy target near in. What? Is that not easy target? That's not the, not that not the easy target. I want easy target. That doesn't seem like an easy target to me. Go after the YZ here. Who is the Ramsey here? Who is the Ramsey such super aggressive here all, all the way inside our, our territory here? Inside the big murder bar here. You think the Ramsey can tank? Just because someone says Ramsey is tanky, he, he went deep inside?
But even the dot is not working out. It's a little lagging. Oh my god, everything. Everything just die. Oh my god, please. Let's get that guy. Oh my god. Just like everything I touch die. We on this guy. We, we, got, we on someone. We are on someone here. And did he die again? Yeah, he did. We got a, a tier the cater here. Damn it, I hit a tier the cater. I hit a tier the cater. Fuck it, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going after that guy. Uh, I'll let that guy die. Let's go here. How about this guy? Is there someone flying over here? Yeah, there is someone flying over. Oh, die so quickly. Go here. Go down here. Let's go down here. Oh boy, oh boy. And we go after that guy. Go after that guy. Like it's lagging. Or right? even even using the dot A is lagging. I'm on someone here. Am I on someone or no? No, I'm not on someone right here. I we I we I we start. I restarted my target. I'm on using Gwan and uh, Pukau here. Gwan and Pukau is being used. Up there. Let's look for some more target here. Let's look for some more easy target here, boy. This one. Easy one, going to what else here? A little slow, probably a, a richer here. Yes! We got a richer here! We got a free kill on the richer here. He's, he is walking. I don't know where he's walking here. But we can definitely get some free kills on him. Let's go and look for, more, for some more target here, boy. Go here. More target here. On someone again. Damn. Man, oh man. These guys just die. These guys just die. Just drop like fly here. <laughs> 1601 dropping like fly here. Oh shoot. Go for this guy. Go for that guy. Go for some more target here. Easy, easy kill. Who the heck is this guy? He's running so fast. Chow Chow? Is it a Chow Chow or what?
Go back here. Who is here? Alex is here. Holy shit. The moment I touch on Alex, he's dead. Uh... Who's standing here? 10 seconds. Yo, by the time we get there, he's dead. Can we get? Can, can, can we touch him? Can we touch? Oh, we, we couldn't touch him. We, could, we couldn't touch on that Alex there. Ooh, we, we want someone. We want someone, boy. Yes, we want someone here. And he's dead again. You want someone here again? Let's go. Cats, give me uh, an AoE skill here, Wan. Yes. One AoE skill here. One, A one AoE skill for the love for all the infantry player. Go here. That picks that target at the gate. Oh, Attila? Uh, no, no, no. I don't want to hit on Attila. School Attila. Who is here? Who am I hitting here? I don't want to hit on Attila. I definitely do not want, want to hit on like a full HP Attila the killer at the gate here. Ooh. Harrow. Harrow is here. Can we hit Harrow here or no? Gwen coming out. Oh, they're pushing out again. Go back here for an easy kill. My HP is pretty low. I don't want to stay too close to the gate. Uh, I want to go for an easy, easy kill here. Zid Grand, for example, is an easy kill. For a second, we should be able to get him. Come on, chase after that Gwen. Go home, boy. Damn, Attila the Killer try to get me here. Gotta avoid that Attila the Killer with all costs. Up here. How long till the, the altar open here? Let me double check real quick. <laughs> Oh shit, one minute. Back, back, back here, guy. I gotta kill some uh, guardian. I gotta kill some of the guardian here for, for the quest. Quickly back inside. Quickly back inside here for the guardian kill. Boy, second. One, two, three. Ten seconds. Faster. 
Need to get the kill in. Need to get three kill for the for the quest. Nope, I missed Dal. I missed Dal on the first wave. I'm gonna wait for the next one, I guess. Oh, someone from Evoe trying to come in to prevent us from capturing the altar here. Hey, we kill. We kill on XY. Uh, we got we got the auto here. That was quick. Here comes sixteen oh one coming in. Let's go. Here comes 1601 trying to prevent us from capturing the altar a bit, bit too late. Who is this guy? Who is this guy here? No, no, no. Don't go. Don't go outside of the, the square here. I need honor points, guy. I'll be pushing for number one top honor ranking. So I want to stay inside here. And not outside. So I'm going to kill whatever inside the box. But not outside the box. Go kill whatever inside the box here. If they're coming in, we're getting them. Let's go there. We're on someone again. Nice, nice, nice. We need to cast a skill for my Gwen. Nice. Stay. And wait. Wait for the next order here. No, don't go outside of the box. Go for that guy. Who is that guy? <laughs> Who's that guy just ran inside? Oh, he's dead. He's dead to us. We on someone again. <laughs> uh, we on someone again here. Anyone else want to come in? Oh, got someone coming in here again. Stay on him. Damn! God damn it, he's dying! 
Are they being a T1? Are they sending T1 to the altar here or what? Everything melted so quickly. Uh, let me check the other side. Let me check the other side of the altar here. Who capturing the other altar here? Uh, where's the other one? Wow, okay. So like Sikino ones, they are not here. Sikino ones, they like, yo, school the altar darkness. Like, we don't need the honor here. So they, they block the gate. They, they force thing. Okay, Sikino one. Okay, all right. At least, at least I get like a thumb up right there for Sikino ones. They like, yo, we're not going to the other altar here. Right, we are going to fight. We are going to fight at this altar here, but they don't have a very good turnout today, right? So kudo right there, kudo right there for Sikino one for not going for the for the easy altar here, right? Uh, they left it altar empty, so nobody, nobody going in here. Nobody is go. Oh, someone get in. Someone still managed to get in here. L six oh one. Oh, he tricked. He got inside. Okay, so he get inside the gate. He he went inside the gate and then he go inside. Okay, got someone. We got someone from 1601 here alone in the altar here. Uh, Neo Muki. Neo Muki from. Oh, Neo Muki and what here? And QQQAP. Okay, three player. Three player from 1601 is at the other side of the altar here. Only three players only. Okay, okay. Uh, 198 seconds there for the for the for the guardian to spawn. Uh, stalker, stalker spawning in about two minutes. Oh my god! Uh, I have 56 million power, 6 million kill boy. Can I migrate to your kingdom after KBK? Uh, you gotta talk to the you got you gotta talk to the leadership. Like I think you should be fine. But I definitely think you should be fine, uh, but like it depends, right? Uh, it depends on, I would say, when you migrate, to be honest with you, with you, right? When you migrate, you gotta you gotta get yourself into like a good alliance, right? So like, migrate into 1860 is one thing, but you, you, you want to be able to get into one of the, one of the good alliance, right? That is something I would try. Uh, so definitely, right, talk to the leadership team and see which alliance they can fit you. And see if it could be a good fit, okay, right? Uh, if if they are, because we are pre we are pre crowded as well, right? I think the, I think the top alliance spot as pre, filled filled up. I think. Uh, I don't know if there are like any other spot for the top three alliances. I think the top three alliances right now in in eighteen sixty are DN one obviously DNT and DNS. Uh, if you want to, I, I would say if you want to grow, you definitely want to get into the top three alliances. Uh, if you're okay, if you're okay to be in, in like other alliance, then by all means. But uh, make sure, make sure you talk to the leadership then. Uh, to see where you where you can be, right? Uh, that is something I would def definitely do. Um, because at the end of the day, you want to be in, in like a good alliance, right? Uh... So, you know, like talk to the leadership team from uh, 1860, right? Uh, talk to some of the player in some of the alliance. I think DN1 and DNT are pretty much full right now. There might be some spot in DNS. There might be. Uh, I cannot guarantee you. Uh, you. You gotta find out for yourself. I do not have those information. Okay, guys, I, I can check on the chat now, guys. Uh... Uh, signal one as <laughs> is signal one a dead kingdom? Nah, uh, I think they're not. They're not trying hard here. They're not trying super hard here for for the altar. Uh, or maybe the timing is not working out for them. Maybe I don't know. I, I'm not here to judge. But uh, 1860 is definitely like 1860 definitely had a lot more players than 1601. There is something I can tell you. Uh, 1860 they have a lot more active fighters than 1601. Uh, let's move the thing on this side. 
Thanks, bro. Hey, you're welcome. Uh, 1104, I think you know one will push. <laughs> oh, shit. I miss I miss the guardian again. The fuck. I forgot the guardian tam. I got I forgot the stalker tam. Hopefully I can get next the next one. Hopefully we can get the next one there. All right, the stalker dying way, way too fast. Uh, I have a two hour. I have two hour here to get some more stalker kills. Oh, king skill being used for the first time. A uh, king skill being used for the first time here. Like we did not even use king skill today. We did not even use king skill today, boy. Uh... Hi, you are asking about me. What do you what do you want to know about me? He know everything about me. Hydra, he 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 know everything about me already. Uh, I will migrate to your kingdom, and it's sixteen forty six million power. You have a six hundred forty six million power or sixty four million power. Like six hundred and forty six million power. For real. <laughs> or are you from 646? Uh, <clears throat> what really? You see it, forty six million power. You like a like a big 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 spanner. Wow, that big. How long you been playing the game? There there are not many big big players that I do I do not know about. Right, I I I like which kingdom are you from? Uh, eighteen sixty is C A or B? We Imperium. <laughs> we Imperium Kingdom. Uh, we are Imperium Kingdom, so we are definitely CA. Uh, but like, the thing is that um, the thing is that like our um, our KBK cycle is a little bit off comparing to some of the big other some of some of the big kingdom, right? I think, I think next one, I think the most, I think like if if thirteen oh seven they going to skip registration. We might be able to face 1307 next KVK. We might. Uh, 1307 is a week ahead of us in terms of like KVK registration. Uh, and they are doing like a 1v3 right now. Right? We can definitely, we can definitely face 1307 in the next KVK, I think. Uh, I think they are like the only kingdoms that uh, I would say kind of like we want to face. We'll see. Uh, we we a little bit too far from 1846 in terms of like KBK. Uh, we won't be able to see 1846 or some of the other like 1556, 1254 for some time, right? Uh, it's gonna take us a lot of like a timing. We had to do a lot of, like skipping and then like waiting for for us to meet them, right? So we won't be able to meet some of the big uh, some of the bigger uh, kingdoms anytime soon, right? I think a lot of people are asking like when is gonna be like 1860 and 1846 rematch, you know? I will like yo we we it's, it's just the timing is not working out, right? The cycle is not there. I think we need to have like a good cycle of like KVK uh to be able to meet them. Uh if we cannot manage to uh to get like a good cycle of KVK uh, it, it's gonna be depend on how how many KVKs they're going to skip as well, right? Uh, if it's in is going to skip another KVK, it's gonna be very very hard for us to meet them. 
Where am I from? I'm from uh, Vietnam, but I, I live in Canada. I migrate to Canada. Uh, 1846 would win. They're on another level. Hey, you never know. You never know. Yo. I, I, I would say I would say 1860 have a good chance against 1846, right? I, I know they are a strong kingdom, but I think we have a good chance. We have a strong fighter here, right? Don't get me wrong. We have a strong fighter here as well. Here you guys, uh, the alliance skill ranking, I guess. We have a decent amount of fire here, right? We can definitely put up a good fight. We can definitely put up a good fight here, right? Look at the end one. Uh, 250 million kills here, right? And we... 18, 1846, they play a lot more KBK than us, right? 1860 is a very, very young kingdom, right? We have a lot of young players here, right? And we have very, very decent amount of kills, right? DN1, 250 million kills. DNS, 114 million kills. DNT, also almost 110 million kills here as well, right? Our top three alliance have very, very high amount of kills for a young kingdom, okay? Like 1846, they have all the OGs there, right? All the OGs migrated there. Don't get me wrong, right? I'm not, I'm not talking down on them. Right? I know they have a good fire, but uh, I wouldn't say that uh, 1846 got be able to run us over. <laughs> and, and again, right? It all depends on like how much resources and how much troop you have. You've been saving up for, for like a big fight, right? It's like. It's like 1401, right? Remember 1401 did like a 2v8 KVK and then everybody, like, oh my god, 1401 is so strong right now, right? Look at their last KVK, right? The last KVK, they, they, they can barely handle like a 1v2. Uh, it's all come down to the time, right? It's all come down to the time of like the, the KVK, right? Uh, how much, how much active fighter you have and how much resources and speed up and how much troop you have are saving up for KVK, right? I would say 1846, they had like a 2-3 easy KBK. Uh, one of the reasons why they were able to do very well again 1916 and 18 uh, and, and 1415. Uh, their KBK scene 3. Uh, KBK scene 3, 1846, they had an easy KBK scene 3. Uh, I think they got, I think they have a 2 easy, I think they have a 2 easy KBK scene 3 win, I think. And they skip. And they skip quite a lot as well. Uh, no, no, they got one easy KVK scene three win, and then they skip three times. They skip three registration to mid 1940, uh, 1916, 1916 and 1415. So they had a lot of resources going into fighting, uh, and I think that's one of the reasons why they was able to do very well, right? Like 1840 KVK scene three, they they fight against uh, 1815. Uh, it was like a super easy KVK for them, right? I think Kingsland, Kingsland for them will only three hours, three hours Kingsland fight for them in uh, in KVK season three. So they got they got easy easy time there. Oh yeah, gotta gotta watch out for the for the stalker guys. Uh, 90, 98 second here. All right, let me let me watch out for the stalker here. I need to get some kill for the stalker kills. Hey man, it's 42. 1846 overrated. Hey, like every every kingdom is overrated until they they meet a, a strong fighting kingdom, right? I there 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 is a it's all depend on like how much like how much of like the people you have uh, in your kingdom that like often on on social media, right? To hype up your kingdom, I would say I would say 1846 they have a lot of people on social media, right? A lot a lot a lot of them on on Discord. A lot of them on Facebook, right? If you are on some of the like, active Discord channels, they are very active, right? You can see a lot of like active this uh, 1846 player, a, a lot of like uh, 1556 player as well, right? You you don't often see you don't often see a lot of like, 1860 player on uh, on Discord or like Facebook talking, right? We just we just here chilling. Uh, again, right? It's all about like, how how much you hyping your kingdom up. And when it comes to fighting, when it comes to fighting, it's gonna be depend on how much how how your kingdom can perform. And hey, 1846, they definitely perform, right? They definitely perform very well in the last KBK, right? Don't get me wrong. And I, I would say I I, I, acno I, I acknowledge them as a strong fighting kingdom, right? Uh, but uh, it's all come down to like how much they how much resource and speed up they gotta have, right? Like they are talking about like an, an easy KBK 
to recover right now, right? Like, just because you have a one tough KBK doesn't mean you can keep going and doing it over and over again, right? Please, give me a kill. Yes, thank goodness. I got one stalker kill, boy. Like, even, even the strongest and the toughest kingdom cannot have a, like a tough KVK back to back, right? 1254, they got like a tough KVK doing 3v5. A 3v, a 3 versus 5 KVK only. And they went for like an easy KVK, right? The, their last KVK were easy. They team up with another strong kingdom, right? Uh, they team up with a uh, strong cam and they got an easy win, right? They recover. Easy KVK, right? Nobody talking about them in the last KVK because, like, it was such an easy KVK for them. Uh, 1846, from what I'm seeing right now on uh, on Discord, they are talking about they might, they might going for an, an easy KVK, right? We'll see, right? Like, can 1846 going for another hard KVK right after the, the last one? I don't think so, right? They definitely going to need a lot of time to recover. So, like... Just the best fine kingdom, but like you decide to go for an easy KVK to recover, then you're not as you're not as tough as you you thought you are, right? Right? Like <clears throat> a tough kingdom is the kingdom that can keep going back to tough KVK back to back, back to back. I would say, right? Maybe, maybe 1365, <laughs> maybe. But hey, I don't know, right? Uh, I, I, I <laughs> like if if your kingdom talking about like hey, uh, we want an easy KVK to recover, right? You're not tough. You're not that tough in my book, okay? That is yet my opinion, okay? That is yet my opinion on what I consider is the strongest, uh, the toughest kingdom in, uh, in in Rise of Kingdom, right? You gotta be able to be like, yo, fuck this game, right? It's all about fighting. We gotta go back to back to like tough KVK here. We gotta challenge ourselves every KVK, right? We're doing 3v5 this KVK. Next KVK, we're doing 2v6. And the next next KVK, we're doing 1v8, 1v6, 1v7, whatever, right? You gotta keep challenging, your, challenging yourself here, right? You're not going like, oh, we gotta have one crazy KVK, and next KVK, we just gotta chill. Hey, it like, so you are either balancing thing out, right? Having like decent KVK every time, or you gotta have a one crazy KVK, and then you gotta have a one like recover KVK, but you do fucking nothing, right? So, hey, that is just my opinion. Like, I know, I know people love to have a fucking like crazy ass KVK with a lot of Imperium Kingdom because. You gain all the fucking attention from all the content queer, everybody streaming your KVK, but hey. At the same time, right? Like, an 8 Imperium KVK is the same as like a fucking 2 Imperium KVK where like the 2 Imperium Kingdom fighting hard each at each other for 2 days. It's the same shit, right? It just, <laughs> it just make it look more like such a like a crazy ass KVK because they're like a fucking 6, 7 Imperium Kingdom into that KVK. But at the end of the day, <laughs> it's like just like a separate fight, like uh, and, and like an each fight there among each kingdom, right? So like, imagine last KVK 1401 fought again 13, uh, 1636, right? For like two three days, then they are in they are in like a six Imperium K K KVK, right? But it's all come down to the two kingdom fighting each other at the first zone. So it could just be like 1401 and 1636 signing up for a Hill Anthem KVK and two kingdom two Imperium King two Imperium kingdom going at each other right there, right? It's same shit. Uh, I just don't like people. Ask, I don't know. Like people nowadays, they just want to have like a KVK with a lot of Imperium Kingdom for whatever reason. I don't get it. It's like it's not like fucking it. Imperium Kingdom can all meet and fight each other anyway, right? You gotta have to like fight one on one regardless. So why just have a fucking you know normal KVK for fuck's sake and to reduce the lags? Like when you have a fucking six Imperium Kingdom in your KVK, the first two hours of everything is unplayable. Unplayable, right? Is it is it even enjoyable for you guys to even play into that KVK where you can't even target any shit when it, when it comes to fighting for the first three four hours of like anything happening, right? When the gate opening, you can't even target, you can't even move, right? You have a five minutes lagging. Is that even worth it? Like, I, I to be honest, to be honest with you guys, I would prefer like a one v one Imperium Kingdom fight, but like they fight for like four or five days straight, right? That's good enough for me, right? I, I don't need, I don't need a fucking 8 Imperium Kingdom KVK, right? Like, it, 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 it make no difference for me. At the end of the day, it's got, it's all gonna come down to like a 1v1, right? Who win 1v1? So, like, I would love to, like, I would love to, like, fighting, I would say right now, right? 
it lies what I'm seeing right now is that 1860 will definitely going to fight 1307 in the next KBK. If if 1307 can manage to recover, I think they are doing like a 1v3 right now. So they might drop Imperium and they might they might try to recruit more players again. And I think I think 1860 can definitely fight them, right? Like for me, right, 1860 versus 1307 is good enough for me. I don't fucking need another two Imperium Kingdom into that KVK, right? Uh, I just want to like uh, head on 1v1, right? 1v1 to see which kingdom is stronger, right? When when you have uh, too many Imperium Kingdom in your KVK and and, and everybody like, oh, we we fight more, we contributed more, and then it's gonna be like a big big arguing of who who hit, who is the actual who actually is the one who who fought more, who contribute more to the winning of the KVK, right? Uh, for me. It's all about like 1v1, right? Challenging another Imperium Kingdom here and there. And just having some fun. Right? I, I, I actually don't like too many Imperium Kingdom in 1kvk, right? The lagging is just too much for me. Right? I, I'm not enjoying it, right? Uh, even, even in like a kvk where there are not that many Imperium Kingdom, right? The lag is probably unbearable already, right? Imagine when you have like fucking 8 Imperium Kingdom in 1kvk, and then when the level 7 get opened, you got like fucking... I for fuck's sake, ten thousand people online, and then it just crash. It just crash the game. Crash the game. Is that is that been worth it? Right. It's not like Lilith it's gonna dedicate like a super super like strong server for like eight Imperium Kingdom anyway. You getting the same fucking server like the same as any other KVK. You getting the same shit as lagging, right? Uh, but it's it's good to look at from the outside, but right? it's good to look at from the outside. But is it even enjoyable from the from the people from the inside or right? doing all the fighting? That is my biggest concern. Why like having like too many Imperium Kingdom in one KVK? Uh, fourteen twelve. What about fourteen twelve? Uh, eighteen forty six top one hundred is better. Yeah, I I don't I don't disagree. Right? Maybe the, I think I think eighteen forty six. I would say not top one hundred, but like the top twenty. I would say the top 20 from 1846, they definitely have a lot more kills than us. But hey, as I mentioned, right? <coughs> uh, it, it's all depend, right? And again, right? Uh, in KVK nowadays, it, 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 it come with a second kingdom as well, right? So like the second kingdom can definitely make up for the lack of power as well. So that is something you need to consider, right? It's not like... It's not like it's it's not gonna be like a one v one KVK nowadays. Sometimes they throwing in like a, a an actual B or C kingdom. Sometimes you can get lucky, right? You can get like a B or C kingdom to make up for your lack of power or your, your lack of firing. So that might happen as well, right? So in last KVK, right? In last KVK, fourteen oh one was alone, and <coughs> sixteen thirty six was with another another kingdom, right? Like a Greek kingdom, right? So. Like 1636 alone, I don't think they can fire again 1401, right? That is just hand out. It's not gonna happen, right? But because 1636 was with another strong fighting kingdom, right? The Greek kingdom was pretty. I would say they were a, they were like a pretty strong fighting kingdom. So like 1636 and that uh, that kingdom was able to, to to put up like a pretty decent fight again 1401, right? They fought again 1401 for two days or three days. Uh, they got pushed back, but it was still like a very very good effort there from both kingdom, right? So nowadays we are talking about a like cam cam power cam fighting power here, right? So maybe maybe uh, 1860 does not have enough fighting power. Maybe the game got to us like another small kingdom to help us out. Maybe that can happen as well, right? Uh, but I do think I do think that 1846 they got a lot more players than us, right? Uh, definitely more players. They got uh, a lot more people migrate there recently, uh, especially the people below 50 million power. I, th I think they have a lot more than us as well. Uh, it, it's like a crowded kingdom, right? I think a lot of people migrate there after the last KBK. Uh, I would say they did a good job in terms of like, recruiting. I would say, right? Very, very good job in terms of like advertising their kingdom. Uh, especially, I think especially after their last KBK, it's like the last KBK is like an advertisement itself for their for their kingdom right there. Uh, I think a lot of a lot of people looking their KBK and be like, oh, they are so good, so let's go migrate there, right? Um, so yeah. Like I think, I think, <coughs> I think when it comes to KVK, I think the like how many, how many like below fifty million power players you have in your kingdom can definitely, can definitely be like a deciding factor. 
I think they are definitely like a design factor there. Uh, to win, to win the KVK or not, right? Zo player, right? Imagine, imagine you have a uh, like a, a actual hundred fifty million power lower player. Oh shoot! Imagine you have a, imagine you have a fifty uh hundred hundred like fifty or below million uh power player, right? And each of Zo player willing to sacrifice one million troop right there, right? That is 100 million troop dead already for for the KVK, right? That is a lot, right? Uh, it's all add up. It's all add up there, right? Uh, and I think I think 1846 got a lot more, a lot more below 50 million power players, like a lot, a lot. Okay, I think I got two stalker kills now. A conical here, two kill, one more kill for today, and I can, and I can go AFK here. Without worrying too much here. Oh, I can get some kill. I can stay here and get some kill for the people running inside. <laughs> I'm 50 million power with 2 billion kills 8.5 million dead wow that's very good then yo don't try to kill me here who is it sad in here I'm sad and try to kick my ass here <laughs> alright <clears throat> there are some really really active like fire that does not have a very high power there are so many of them right? so many of them in the game and uh, zo player can be the design factors right and i think that is what the direction most of the imperium kingdom going at nowadays right uh they are recruiting more like, lower power players right uh it's all come down to the like, number right rise of kingdom is a number game right <clears throat> the only reason the only reason we are winning against 1601 today, you know why? Because you have we have more players. It's simple as that, right? KVK is all about the number game, right? If your opponent bring out 100 matches, 100 players, and you bring out 150 players, like it doesn't matter how much, how high research they have, they can have all maxed out research for all I care. If they have 100 players, and you have 150 players, you gotta win, right? It doesn't matter how many research, how much tech they have, how much they spend in the game. Like the more players you have, you you gotta win, right? In terms of like open field fighting, uh, maybe maybe when it comes to a like rallying or garrisoning, right? Having a big big having like a big spender can definitely help out. But uh, open field fighting, right? Which is the most I would say like the most important thing. Uh, the most important thing in in Rise of Kingdom is open field, right? Uh, it's it's all about the number game, right? You can have you can have the best garrison or the best rally leader. But if you don't have a, if you don't have open field, right, your your rally is gonna, gonna get get killed, no matter what, right. You don't have a, you don't have people reinforcing it, right. Your rally is gonna die. Uh, so it's all about like, do you have a, do you have, do you have the player, do you have the player on the field, right? Uh, so number game, right. That is why we see kingdom trying to recruit a lot of players, like getting crazy amount of players inside the kingdom, uh, trying to be one of the top kingdoms there, right. Uh, but again, right, for me. They're like a pro and con for like being one of the top kingdom, right? When you have too many players in your kingdom, it's just too hard to do anything. Especially if you're like a below 50 million power. Right? If you're below like 50 million, below 60 million power, right? And if you're not like very, very competitive, like going into like a big kingdom, you're not gonna be able to perform a lot of things, right? You can do a lot of events. Uh, it's just not worth it for me, right? And 
Like you gonna have to fight some of the bigger bigger spender as well, right? Bigger bigger, right? Some of the mega mega spender, right? Imagine, imagine if you like a very not super active fighter, and then you go into into like eighteen forty six or eighteen sixty, like you won't be able to get a lot of kills, and the kingdom have a higher expectation for you as well. So that is the downside, right? And there are too many players, right? Like when it comes to like mighty gun event, your chance of winning is gonna be very very slim. <laughs> Close to zero. Uh, the chance of winning other event like power up event, troop training event, as got pre gonna be pretty much close to zero as well, right? So when you are going into some of those big kingdom, you are you are giving up on your chance of like uh, uh, winning some of those events. But if if you can manage to get some of, if I would say if you can manage to get in some of the top alliance, they can definitely make up for the lack of like, or uh, you not, you might not be, you might not be able to win some of the event, but uh, you gain some other stuff back, right? In terms of like golden chest, uh, or land gift, uh, they can definitely get you more speed, speed up as well. So that like a pro, uh, pro and cons for like getting into like a big, big ass kingdom, right? Uh, I wouldn't recommend any like, I, I, I would say I, I wouldn't recommend any forty million or lower power players getting into some of the some of the big imperium kingdom, right? You just gotta be mid shell, right? Uh, like when when some of the like I would say below four million power players ask, asking me if they wanna go to eighteen sixty, I'd be like, um, you better you better go to like a smaller kingdom for you to be able to enjoy the game more, right? Like a like a forty million power players getting into like eighteen sixty, uh, they might not be able to do a lot, right? You might feel left out. They might feel left out there. I I would say I don't know, like. You got, you gotta have the power. You gotta have the power. You gotta have the commanders to to fight in some of the big kingdom there, right? Otherwise, you just gotta be mischief, right? Reinforcing structure, feeling rally, right? You gotta be a nobody, right? Do you want to be like a nobody in in Rise of Kingdom here, right? You gotta you wanna be a hero, you know? You you playing this game, you wanna be somebody. You wanna be someone, right? You you want you you want people to know your name, right? Right. You, you, you don't want to be a, like a nobody here. One more, one more kill for the for the altar. Okay, let me send back my. Uh, I'm gonna send back my marches here for for gathering. I gotta gather gold here. Hey, Lee Kim Son, you're from 1860. What you what you in game name? Is that a turkey marker? <laughs> uh, I am 65 million power, 61 million death, ID 61 million, two billion kill, and six million dead. Wow, Lee Kim Son, you you're very good, son. Right? Uh, for like a six for like a 65 million ID. For like a 65 million ID and you got like a 2 billion kills, that is very good. You are much much better than me. <laughs> you, are, you, are, you are much stronger player than I am then. Do you spend a lot in the game? Like I know Korean players, they, I, I know Korean can spend quite a lot of money in the game. Right? I think I think uh, the, the bundle are cheaper in uh, in Korea, right? When's the next spawn thing? When's the next spawning time here? 70 seconds. 70 seconds, getting one more kill, and I'm, uh, I'll am i be good. Go over here for not many players. Master Yi? Oh, you Vietnamese. Why why your name is Lee Kim San? Are you, do you live in uh, Người Việt Nam, hả? Master Yi, Người Việt Nam, hả? Are you Vietnamese or what? Are you Vietnamese or Korean? Master G DN one. Why the heck you name yourself Lee Kim John? Uh, I am 52, 52 million power, one billion kill, eight million death. That is very good. That is a very very good stat for like a fifty million power players. 
I think you can get in any kingdom, I think. I think any kingdom would love to have you. A very, very good stats right there for like a low power players. Let's get my last kill here for the stalker. And we're done for the day. Uh, let's go and check on uh, 1307 KVK a little bit, okay guys? Uh, maybe we, we, we can see something interesting there. Let's check on the level 7 gate for a little bit here. Right, how are they doing here? Uh, Kingsland. Kingsland is opening today for 13, 1307. Uh, they are doing like a 1v3 here. Uh, can they... Are they burning some fort here or no? Right, they are not burning on, uh, on uh, 2018 here. Uh, no fort burning here. We got some uh, one AVG player here, but uh, nothing is burning. Uh, they are definitely preparing for Kingsland, I think. Definitely. How's the other get looking? How is it get looking here? So no fort burning. No fort burning here. So we'll see. Like I am, I am very, very excited to see what uh, thirteen oh seven gonna do today, right? Like one v three, one v three in Kingsland is gonna be rough. One v three in Kingsland is gonna be very, very rough. Uh, so let's see here, right? Do they have what it take? Do they have what it take to uh, to hold, to hold, to hold Kingsland here for I don't know? Can they, do you, do you think? Do you think thirteen oh seven can hold Kingsland for one day? Right, I don't think they can. Right, I don't think they can hold Kingsland for one day, but I could be wrong. But uh, I think I think they wouldn't be able to have uh, the open field control. Right, I think the field control is gonna be like a very very rough for them today. Uh, when's the level eight get opening here? Five hours. Damn, five hours from now is what time? Five hours from now is five hours from now is seventeen UTC. Wow. 17 UTC, we gotta have a 1307 in Kingsland, 1v3. Okay. But uh, look like everybody is uh, resting. Everybody is resting right now for that KVK Kingsland opening. Uh. My neighbor of Vietnam does that cow also. Hey, that cow, that cow, rot, rot all. Go, Master G. Who won the sanctuary zone? In in which zone? In uh, thirteen oh seven. Uh, thirteen oh thirteen oh seven. They won both both zone. Uh, thirteen oh seven. They won both zone. Zone five. But uh, the other one. Sanctuary is here, right? This one is Sanctuary, right? Yeah. Yeah. 1307, they won both zones. But uh, I think they got a struggle. I definitely think 1307 got a struggle in Kingsland because they got had to like 1v3. 1v3 on the open field is tough. 1v3 on the open field is going to be tough. And it's going to be very difficult for them to maintain that uh, field feel present all the time, right? They go had to they go had to like garrison their structure pretty much all the time. Right. They they probably cannot get on the offense, right? And they go had to de they ha they had to depend on their Xano and YSS a lot today. Right. Keep feeding the, the flag, I would say. I I would say there is no way. There is no way in hell. There is no way in hell that 1307 gonna be able to have a maintain like a big murder ball today. Uh, when it comes to like, uh, when it comes to a garrisoning, we'll see, we'll see. Maybe, maybe the first few hours they can maintain the murder ball for the first few hours. But like, I think as the game, I think as the as the as the Kinglands opening keep like dragging on and on, the time go on. Uh, I think they gonna lose out, right? I think when when the three the three can meet up, they gonna have a a crazy crazy amount of players on the field. Right, a crazy, crazy amount of play on the field, and it's gonna be very, very tough for for thirteen oh seven to do anything. Right, it's it just it's just very, very difficult to fight one v one v three. Right, 
Even even 1v2 is gonna be tough. Hey, thanks for the donation, Hussein. Hope win KVK and Zenit. Hey, thank you, thank you. I'll try my best. I'll try my best to win Zenit or Power Event. Uh, I am trying. I'm, I'm trying to maintain my resources here, right? I'm, I'm, I'm doing a small hill here. I'm not doing big hill. I'm doing uh, like a 3,000 unit healing at, the sa at, at, at one time here. Because that can save on speed up here. Uh, trying to farm more gold as well. Uh, gold is the only thing I'm missing right now. The only thing I'm missing right now for Zenith of Power is gold. So go try to farm more here. Farm more gold, farm more gold. Uh, got some gems there. Could definitely farm some gem for now. Definitely farm some gem for now, and we'll get some gold after. Uh, showing you guys my speed up, okay? I have a three thousand day, three thousand day worth of speed up here. So I got two hundred thousand in in one minute here. Two hundred thousand in one minute. 6,000 here in 5 minutes. I don't have a lot of like 10 minutes here. 15 minutes, 30 minutes, not a lot. I got 2,000, 6 minutes, 60 minutes here. I got 203 hours. Almost fine at 8 hours here. Uh, 6, 15 hours. And then we're going to the universal speed up here. 150,000, 1 minute. 1,000, 5 minutes here. Right. I think I have a lot of like 6, I got almost 7,000, 3 hours here. So I think this is my big chunk. My big chunk of speed up is here. 6,000, 3 hours speed up right there. Uh, 1,000, 8 hours speed up here as well. Uh, 24,000, 60 minutes speed up here, which is quite a lot as well. Uh, 3 day, 4 3 day speed up, and 44, 24 hours speed up here. So this is like a 44 days already. Is that like a 1 month? 1 month would have speed up here already. Is it like a 2 month, 3 months here? Uh, I have like a total of like 3,000 days. 3,000 days worth of speed up that I can use for training. So I'm going to use everything. Everything for Zenit of Power event. Uh, the only chance they have is to build a world of flag and hold that world against the two camps. And try single out one or two cam and try focus them out as fast as you can uh, <laughs> like they just don't have the player <laughs> doesn't matter what they do right Kingsland is like a big open field right right now they can hold the gate right right now they can hold the gate because because the cam they cannot share the pass that's the biggest the biggest issue right now for the other side is that the cam they cannot share the gate so they cannot go like they cannot like have a one cam take the gate and then the other cam can go inside to the gate that is, that is their biggest issue right now but when Kingsland opening, it's gonna be a different story because now all the camps are gonna be all together here, right? And when they are together, they are stronger, right? Same thing, right? Rise of Kingdom is a number game. Like when when you have like a 50 margin fighting alone, right? Compared to when you have like 150 margin fighting alone, right? So like let's say, let's say 1307. 1307 they have 100 margins, right? 100 margins at the gate. And the other camp, right? Each camp they have a 75 margins at the gate, okay? So, if each camp going to use 75 margins to 500 margins from 307, they gonna lose, right? But then, and the other camp, they cannot bring the other 75 margins to, to the gate to help the other camp, right? So, like, every time they fight, it's always like a one, like, uh, it's, it, 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 it not, they're not fighting at the, the full power, right? But when Kingsland open, right? Kingsland open is when you can see the full power of all the camps all together, hundred percent firing power there, and it's gonna be very very difficult, very very difficult to maintain the open field, right? Like even for myself, right? Even for myself, when I'm fighting, when I'm fighting aggressively, right? Even like one v one situation, right? When I'm fighting aggressively. Uh, the amount of resource it costs to fighting like, aggressively, right? When you fight aggressively, you often fight like, 1v3, 1v2. Like, I am burning a lot of resources, right? Just for the open field, they wouldn't be, they wouldn't be able to last very long, right? It just, it, it's all about that, um, uh, 
uh, it's all about like it's all about uh, how long you can fight, how long you can fight in King's Land, and I, I I just honestly don't see, I just honestly don't see 1307 gonna be able to 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 fight for very very long. That is just my guess. Who is this guy going? In? Oh, let's go pick up some chests here. Someone, someone, someone from 1601 is trying to steal our chests here, boy. Kick the ass. Let's kick the ass here. Who is this guy going trying to pick up a chest here? What the heck? Who is it, Guan Leo here? I think there are a lot of AFK player here at the corner. Lots of AFK player. Golden key. Who is picking up the golden key here? Okay, so let's go back to like 1307 here, right? Let me let me talk a little bit here, right? So like the biggest issue right now for the other camp is that let's say when when uh, 2018, right? When 2018 they, ca they capture the capture the gate. When 2018 they capture the gate, the other camp, right? 15, 2015 here, they cannot come over, right? So like alone, alone 2018, they cannot push back on 1307 alone. Same go for 2015 as well, right? If 2015 they capture the gate by themselves, they cannot push back on 1307. It's impossible for them, right? Because of the gate, the gate is uh, the biggest barrier right here for the other camp from pushing back 1307. Because they cannot fight together, right? They can only hold, they, they can only defend the gate here, right? That is the biggest issue I'm seeing right now with the other camp. Uh, same go for the other side as well, right? So the other side here, right? Uh, if, if 2018 here, right? If 2018 they capture the gate here, right? They only have one freaking alliance here, right? How is 2018 gonna be able to push back on one AVG and TW with only one single alliance, right? They can only play defensively here, right? Uh, 16 A3, right? I would say 16 A3 alone, right? Even if 16 A3 they capture the gate alone, right? It's gonna be pretty tough for them as well to push back on like 1307 alone, right? And I think that is one of the reasons why they're not trying to push back on 1307. Uh, they are just waiting here, right? But like when Kingsland open, when Kingsland open, right? If if 1307 going to lose Kingsland, right? They have to defend two other gate here, right? They have to defend this level eight gate, this level eight gate here, right? So there gonna be like a four points of entry here for uh, for the other camp, right? So the other camp can go to this gate here inside 1307 zone. They can go to this gate here inside 1307 zone. Inside this gate here, right? So 1307 now, right? When if they lose Kingland, right? They have to split up their fighting power into like a four different spot right here, right? They gonna have to like put one alliance here, another alliance here, defend it level eight gate, another alliance here, defend it level eight gate here, and another alliance here to de defend it level seven gate here, right? That is when that is when the other the other camps they have a, their biggest chance of pushing back on 1307, right? But as of right now, right? Shang the gate, Shang the gate right here is the biggest issue. The biggest issue to the other team, right? They cannot, they cannot push back on 1307 alone. That is the biggest problem for them, right? Alone, alone they cannot win. Alone they cannot win against 1307. But together, but together is a different story. When they are together, it's gonna be rough. We'll find out. We'll find out soon enough in four hours, right? Uh, maybe, maybe 1307 got pulled together, but like from what I'm seeing so far, from what, from what I'm seeing so far, right, 1307, they don't have what it take. They don't have what it take to push back on the enemy kingdom, right? Like if they have what it take, they should have pushed back on the, at least one side already. But right now they are playing very defensively, right? Very, very defensively. And they got play defensively again in Kingsland as well. Uh, it's just, it's just, it's just a matter of how long, how long they can hold in Kingsland.
Uh, hopefully. Hopefully someone got streams at KVK today. Like, I don't know why Dragotin not streaming it. Like, they streaming it for a little bit, for like two hours only, and then nobody's streaming it at KVK. Uh, which is kind of boring, you know? Hopefully we have something to watch today, okay guys? Hopefully, hopefully Dragotin got streams at KVK today. Uh, I would love to like, I would love to sit on the couch and then just like watch that to see, to see 307 gang wreck. <laughs> We got to see 307 gang wreck today, guys. I, I, honestly, I just want to see how long they can hold. That's the only thing I care about. The only thing I care about that KBK is I want to see how long, how long they can hold in King's Land. Yeah, right. Uh, as they, as they are, as they gonna be as good as they think they they are. Like 1307, they've been top Imperium Kingdom for a long, long time, right? They in they've been at the top, and they haven't lost. They haven't lost any KVK since I think they lost. I would tell that they lost their first KVK, but uh, they they haven't lost any other KVK ever ever then. Uh, we were, I was in 1291, and and we were with them in one KVK, and and we won as well. Uh, you can see B18, AA15, and DF18. I mean, 1307 will be able to push on 2018 and 2015. Uh, I don't think so. Like, they can only push. I I say they can only push the kingdom when they are alone. Right? When they are together, it's very very hard to push back on them. Uh, even even if even if uh, 1307 focus on on one side. Even if they focus on one side, it's gonna be very, very rough. Very, very rough to push back on two strong A kingdom at the same time. Uh, f uh, not from what I'm seeing so far. Right, not from what I'm seeing so far. It's gonna be very tough for them to push back on those two kingdom. Uh, let me see here. Uh, let's go back to the level seven pass here. Right. So like when King's Land open, right? When King's Land open, we got a we got have a 1307 building in, right? They have a two alliance coming here, and about like a three alliance coming here, right? So 13, 1307, they bringing in five alliances, right? Five five alliances building inside King's Land, right? And here we got AA15, right? AA15 coming here. We got RH15 coming here. We got DF18 coming here. Uh, so that like a three alliance coming this direction already. Uh, we got RS, we got like 15 coming from this direction here. It might take, it might take some time for 2015 to build up, but hey, like they can walk up here. They can walk up here and push back on 1307 in terms of like open field, right? It's all about that open field present, right? And I think they got a struggle. They definitely got a struggle in terms of open field present, I think. Uh, right? 1683. 1683 is gonna walk up there, right? They're gonna walk up here with uh, the other the other camp, right? I just don't see I just don't see uh 1307 got to hold very long here. Maybe, maybe they got surprised. Maybe the player in their kingdom got zero themselves, you know? You never know. Uh, let, let's look at AVG here. Uh, did they drop a lot of power or not here? Uh, did they drop a lot of power or no? Let's see here, one AVG. Look at some of the player here. Uh, NAS Mass Phantom. Uh, wow, he dropped 200 million power already. Already 200 million power drop already. That crazy. Uh, they are dropping power. They are dropping power here so that they can uh, recruit more player, I guess. Uh, this one is Mad Phantom here, main account. Uh, only 100 million power losses so far. Uh, AVG, who's this guy here? Don't even know who this guy is. Uh, 39 million power down to 108 million power here. Well, it's pretty good, pretty good so far. Uh, but no one, no one have a zero themselves yet, right? I would say, to be honest with you guys, like I would say, 1307 biggest chance to win is to push in this zone right here, right? I would say. Their biggest chance to win is in this zone. They gotta push back the enemy in this zone here. Because in this zone, they can do 1v2, right? They can do 1v2 other kingdom here, right? 
And they have their biggest chance of winning in here. They got to push back on the enemy here, right? They got to focus on one direction only. That if I was them, right? If I was, if I, if I were one, if I was 1307, if I were 1307, I would definitely focus on one direction only, right? And using fort to block the other side, right? Fort blocking the other side here, uh, preventing them from coming in, and then trying to break my way in, right? Trying to break my way in here, in one of the zone here, right? Fighting, fighting in this zone is gonna be a lot easier, right? Trying to break in here, and then preventing one of the kingdom from coming inside the king's land here, right? Fighting them, fighting them separately is gonna be a lot easier, right? When you go into, like, you laying off the three kingdoms going into Kinglands here, it got to be very, very hard, right? So that if I was, if, if I were 1307, I would definitely be focusing on one direction only and trying to get as much good trade off as I can. Uh, burn down the fort here and then build my way in, right? Build my way in here, uh, cutting them off, right? Cutting them off from, like, gangs access to this level 8 gate here, right? Cut them off from the two level 8 gate here would be my, uh, I would def I would definitely be trying to cut one of the kingdom off if I were 1307, right? In terms of strategy wise, right? Like focusing on one dire dire direction here, cut them off from the two level eight gate here. I would say that is their highest chance of winning. That is that is their highest chance of winning this KVK. But uh letting laying all the three camps going going inside Kingsland is gonna be tough. Very, very tough, right? Very, very tough there for them find one V3. They could definitely try it. They could definitely try it here, but it's too late now. It's too late for them to try it now. Or even going to this direction here, right? Maybe. Maybe they, sh they, sh they should have gone on this direction here, right? Because 2015 is a very, very young kingdom. Right? 2018 is also a very, very young kingdom as well, right? Fighting, fighting against two young kingdom is gonna be easy. They gotta get they gotta be able to get a very, very good trade-up against them, right? If they can put like a very, very high pressure on them. Uh, and they don't, they lacking the experience as well, right? Like the Jung Kingdom, they don't have very, very high experience with the new KVK here, right? So they don't know what to do. They might make a mistake here and there. And 1307 can definitely utilize the mistake from the two Jung Kingdom here, right? And and getting very, very good trade-off against them, right? So like, if I was them, right? If I was them, I would definitely pushing my, like, 100% firing power to the right side here, right? Trying to push back on 2015, and 2018 here, right? And then cut them off from the two level 8 gate here, right? Preventing. Preventing uh, 2015 and 2018 from accessing this gate here. And then when Kingsland open, uh, go try something else, right? Uh, I would say that is something I would do. Uh, preventing the enemy from going inside Kingsland by a lot. Uh, and possibly even trying, even trying to capture the other level 7 gate as well, right? To be honest, to be honest with you guys, it's better. It's better for, for 1307 to fight, to fight the other camp, right? 1v2, 1v1, right? Then 1v3. Right? 1v3 in Kingsland is a bad choice. Right? 1v3 in Kingsland is a bad choice. I, I would give up on... I would, I would give up on Kingsland on the first few days, right? Let them... Let them take Kingsland, right? Let them take Kingsland here, right? And we... We gotta cut them off from, from the outside. So that is something I would do. If I am... If I'm going to like plan out like a 1v3... KVK here, right? Like, I would definitely, I would definitely avoid fighting them all at the same time at all costs. No matter what happened, I would definitely try to fight. I would definitely try to avoid fighting them all at once, right? Fighting them all at once is gonna be very, very difficult. That is my opinion, right? Uh, I'm not, I'm not in 1307. I don't know what their plan is. I'm just saying that is something I would do. If I am leading a, if I'm leading a, like a kingdom doing like a 1v3 KVK. Uh, I would definitely, I would definitely try to avoid fighting 1v3. Right? Even, even though we are fighting like a 1v3 KVK, but we, we have to try. We have to try avoid situation where we have to fight 1v3, right? We want to do, we want to try to do as much 1v1 as we can. And we want to try to do as much 1v2 as we can before we, before we even going to like do like 1v3. Holy shit, they are fighting here. What is this guy doing here? What is this guy doing here? Try and kill off my player?
Who am I fighting here? Let's go get that guy. We kill boy. We kill. Let me cast a skill here. My Gwen is dying. I'm gonna stay inside the box here. How long till the ruin? Uh, 53 more minutes. 53 more minutes here. Ah, <laughs> uh, shoot. Uh. Oh, there's some fighting here. Hey, uh, do I need to refresh my markets here for some more firing here? Uh, what my honor ranking look like here? I might, I might go kill some barbarian today. I might. My honor ranking is at rank number 15. I am rank number 15 here, but I'm gonna go for rank number 1. I'm gonna go for rank number 1 in this KVK. Going for rank number one in honor ranking, boys. We got some healing buff going on. Let's clear out the hospital here. Spam the heal. What? Oh shit, I thought they like a bug. <laughs> it wasn't healing. It wasn't healing there. Three thousand. I can heal three thousand T5 here. Ooh, you know what? Uh I messed up. Oh, 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 six hour. One second, boy. Uh, let me uh, let me invest into some of the better healing costs. Oh shit! I need marching level seven. Uh, not not there yet. <laughs> not there yet. <laughs> uh, let's upgrade my research here again. Five twenty four thousand. Oh, I don't have a crystal. Not enough crystal, guys. Damn, 2 million gold today. Where's the 2 million gold today for fighting? Um, I want to, uh, what do I want to do right now? Oh, 
I need to reset my batch in quest. Uh, I am so bad at doing batch in quest, guy. I haven't unlocked my uh, Saturn yet. I did not unlock my Saturn. I did not unlock my uh, my Chow Chow. What the heck? What have I done? Uh, where is where is the Saturn? Um, where is the Saturn batch in here? I'm level two. As Van Leather here. I do not want to donate that. Hmm. Oh, decent amount of firing down here. Maybe we can get some kill down here as well. Maybe. Damn. You know one is not here? Wow. You know what? He's not there. How's our... Did they want to eat our allies? Our allies getting a... Uh, auto here. Our allies are getting an auto darkness there. Any fighting here? Yeah, our allies are not fighting here. Our ally is definitely not fighting there. Hey, what else can I do? Some batching quests here. Uh, like one of the reason, one of the reason I I am not doing very well in terms of the batching quest because I do um I tr I pre train. I pre-train my troop here so that I can I cannot do some of the uh, batching quests to do with troop training, right? So very very bad timing for me, very very bad timing for me here with it KVK. Right? We got the sand of power event happen at the same time here, and uh, I don't have a uh, I I am training some troop here in my uh, in my bar barrack here so that I can save some speed up as well when the uh, sand of power event happens. So I cannot do, I cannot complete some of the quests here for the batching quests here, right? I'm saving up, I'm saving up some of the troop training quests here so that I can, I can do later. Uh, but I cannot do it right now, so I gotta wait. I gotta wait here. Uh, when Zenith of Power even happen, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna accept all of the training quests here and I'm gonna do probably 15 training quests in one day. <laughs> that is my plan. My plan is to have a, like, fucking 14, 15 training quests ready. When Zenit Power event happens, I'm gonna accept them all and do them all at once. So that I can gain uh, more crystal as well. Hopefully, hopefully we're gonna have a Zenit Power event next week, right? Next week. So it's gonna come. I, I, I want it to come early, right? If, if it come in two weeks, it might interfere with my uh, KVK fighting, right? If it come in two weeks, that is when the level 7 get opening. Uh, it could be like a horrible, horrible timing. Right, if I'm gonna go all out in that event, then I have no resources left for fighting, which is not good, right? Uh, 1860 people is gonna hit me. 1860, 1860 players they gonna hit me there for not uh, for not performing well in KVK. So hopefully, hopefully then it a power event gonna happen right after the update, right? So right after the update, I think it's gonna happen on sad on Friday or Saturday. I think that is when I can definitely, I can definitely go ham. Uh, hopefully that go, gotta happen. That is my 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 hope right now. I, I definitely want it to happen before before Kingsland happening here, right? Not not doing Kingsland fighting, right? Not doing Kingsland fighting or, or not like doing level seven gate opening. Uh, eighteen sixty is gonna hit me. Eighteen sixty gonna hit me for using everything I have for Zenith of Power event. Uh, we'll see. Then the power event might be next next week. It might, it might, or it can it, it can come right after. It it can come right after the update as well. It happened before. It happened before that Zen power event happened right after the update. It's happened. So that is my hope right now. My hope right now is that right after the update, 
we got to see the, the Zenith Pell event right away, right? It's got to it's gonna show up in three or four days. That is my hope right now. Uh, because, right? Because it's supposed to be an uh, anniversary, right? An anniversary event. And, like, we already, we, already, we, we already celebrate anniversary already, right? So, like, if, if it's like a... If it like a two weeks from now, if it like a two weeks from now event, then it's like way way past anniversary of the Rise of Kingdom already, right? So like, so I think I think it's gonna happen earlier, right? Because last year, a uh, last year anniversary, a uh, then it happened on September third, right? It's like a first day. It's like a first first day of September, right? Last last year. Last year, September 3rd, 2020, that is, that is when Zenith Power event happened. That was also doing anniversary as well, and it's, it's happened early, right? This year is a little bit slow, a li we're, we're a little bit behind here, okay? So hopefully they're going to speed up a little bit, hopefully, that is my hope. My hope is that they're going to speed up a little bit so that we can, uh, we can have a Zenith Power event super early. Uh, I finished my quest, right? Yeah, I finished the three stalker killing here. I am good. Boy, three minutes here still. Uh, usually it's Thursday to Sunday, yeah? Hopefully. Hopefully we gonna see it on on the Thursday here. Hopefully. I, I, I really hope it happen early. Right? I, I definitely... I definitely do not want it to happen fucking when the level 7 get open. <laughs> because next week, next week Thursday is when the level 7 get opening. Like, I'm gonna be fucking training when everybody fighting. Like, 1860 gonna kick my fucking ass. <laughs> 1860 gonna kick my ass if I don't fight. <laughs> if I don't fight next, next when the level 7 get open. <laughs> and I'm gonna be troop training instead. Oh my god, they gonna kick my ass. They're gonna be like, yo, bye bye is not fit anymore for DN1. Uh, you, you go to DN2. You go to DNT. <laughs> uh, we'll see. We'll see here. Please do not get do not do not make Zenith or Power Event happen next next week. So tomorrow. We'll find out tomorrow. Tomorrow is uh tomorrow is the 13th, right? Uh tomorrow is the 13th is when the update kick in. Uh, let me double check on the date here. Uh, double check on the date here. Where is the uh, system mail? Where is the system mail for the update? Uh, anniversary festival. We plan to update the game version 1.0.50 at around 13, September 13 here. Uh, before the update, you can download data in advance via event to earn nice rewards. We apologize for any inconvenience. Uh, and when is it event gonna happen here? Uh, anniversary festival event will go live within a week. Oh, it's go live right away. It's a, it, it, it will go live within a week of the update here. So it might, it might go live right away. Oh shit, it's next week. It's next, next week. Oh shit. If. If the update happening tomorrow, if the update happening tomorrow, then oh shit, it might, it might be next next week. A treasure outlaw. Oh shit. Is that like a date here? Anniversary festival, seven day of questing for great rewards. Hmm. Anniversary shop exchange for variety of uh, variety of price, including a new city team. Okay. Uh, get mementos by collecting resources in your city. Sharp eye, quick hand event, arms training. It didn't. It didn't say the fucking date here. Uh, now governor receive more detailed classification of battle reports. Blah blah blah. No date announced. But it, it might be next week. It might be next week, right? If we have the update kick in today, and then the event kick in, hmm. 
We got Shadow. Oh my god. We got, we got Shadow Legion. Oh my god. We, we have a, so many events happening next week. We have a Shadow Legion event. We have a Soul Crisis. We have My Army. We have Seal Road here. We have, we have Holy Knight. Oh shit. Can they fit in? Can they fit in four more event here though? I don't think they can. I don't think they can fit in more event. Oh my god, it's gonna happen during the gate opening! Freaking hell! Uh, this is horrible. This is horrible, guys. Horrible! A lot of war. Man, I'm, I'm gonna be on vacation as well! What the heck? I'll be on vacation for Zenit Pal event. Please don't do this to me here. Monday. Update on Monday. Uh, update on Monday here. Shit. That's why it next next week. Most probably, yes. Oh my god, this is bad. Very, very... Why? Why is such a, like, a bad timing? Like... This KVK is a horrible timing for me. Right? The level 7 get open is when I have a, I have to travel. And Zenit Appel event also happened when I had to travel as well. Don't do this to me, Lilith. Please. No. Do not do this to me here. Lilith is playing with me here with, with the timing. Lilith is playing with me here with the timing here. Dark Dewey is getting killed. Okay, okay. Oh, Lilith hitting me. Let me focus on healing here a little bit here. Focus on healing. I gotta clear my hospital for Ark. We got Ark later today at uh, 1 at 20 UTC. 20 UTC, I have an Ark of Osiris. So I gotta prepare for it, guys. Uh, got to clear our hospital. Uh, when you think Zenit will start out? It usually, it, 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 it's gonna be next Thursday or the next, next Thursday. Uh, most likely, most likely two weeks from now. Most likely. hai tuần nữa em hai hai tuần nữa à chắc hai tuần nữa hiếu à thứ 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 năm tuần sau tuần sau nữa ok gotta get back gotta get back to farming here boys uh, gotta farm more go People still fighting here. I gotta do some work on my farm. Uh, got boosting the farming resources here as well.
That's one. Uh, help your lance member. Item. The heck? How come this one not help your allies 20 times? I have already. How come I haven't finished this, this one yet? Okay, finally. Finally help someone there. Let's do a sunset cannon attack here. Oh, I changed my equipment. I'm gonna lose. Yeah, fuck. I didn't change back my equip my my equipment. Unlock this one. Unlock this one here. Farm, farm, farm. Go. Give me go. Thank you. Uh, people are still fighting here. That's good. Uh, where is my honor ranking at? My honor roll. 108,000 here. I had to kill Barbarian very soon. I, I will have to kill Barbarian very, very soon. Gotta go farm some Barbarian here. Uh, there is no... There is no event coming up. There is no event coming up for for killing barbarian here. God damn it! Like before the level seven get open. Before the level seven get open, I want to see like an event that dropping like supply boxes or dropping that lower things. So that I can use my action points to kill daily gathering here. Please, Lilith, be nice to me. Do you one minute? Within a week, less than seven days. It could be tomorrow. Yes, that's what I'm hoping for. That's what I'm hoping for. Right? Within a week. Is that what? what is that what I am interpreting them from? Is that what they mean? Uh, within a week, it could be within a week, like within seven days of the the release of the update. It could come up, but I don't know, right? Because there are like, so many events right now. That's the thing is. The issue right now is that there are like a one, two, three, four, five, six. There are like a six event already going on, right? For them to for them to like uh, for them to like um, activate like a whole bunch of like new events, it's gonna be way way too much thing going on. I think so. It might not happen next. It it might not happen right away. It might not happen right away. Is my guess, but I could be wrong. But right? you never know. They could add a whole bunch of like event down here. They could. We'll see. We'll, see. We'll, we'll find out soon enough. We'll find out by tomorrow when the update kick in. I just hope they don't delay the, the update though. Right? You know, sometimes they, do, they delay the update, right? And that is not going to be good for me. I definitely do not want them to delay it. Uh, I see. It usually from Saturday to Tuesday. Oh, uh, is it? Is it usually from Saturday to Tuesday? Like, if it happened, what if it happened tomorrow? Uh, 
Like if it, I think it's it usually it happen on it, it usually happen on Thursday, no? Like I was seen, I or Friday. Like I was seen a Zenith of Power event that cost over with like a power increase event. I think. I think I remember. I I was seen one Zenith of Power event cost over with like a power increase event. Right? I I I don't think it, it I don't think it's coming over the weekend. I think it. I think I think it run from like uh, Friday. I think it's run from like Friday to uh, Friday to, to Monday or something. I think it run from like Friday to Monday. Let me check here. Let me check when the last time. Okay, the last the last uh, Zenith of Power event was June 19. Let me check the date on June 19 here. So June 19 was which day? Okay, June 19 was Saturday. Okay, okay. So, Zenith of Power event. Zenith of Power event happened on the Saturday, guys. So, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Hmm. That was the last time. The last time on June 19, it was on Saturday. So, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. What about April 3rd? Uh, April 3rd is what day? April 3rd. Okay, okay, okay. So, April 3rd is also Saturday, okay? So Zenith of Power event always happened on Saturday here, right? So April 3rd is also Saturday here. Let me check September 3rd, 2020 here. Which day is that? Hmm. So like, September 3rd, 2020 is on Thursday. Okay. So sometime, sometime it happened on Saturday, sometime it happened on Thursday. It could be, it, it could be either day. But I think I think they might have an update. The they, they 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 might have a change the date. They they might have a change the date after after MGE update. I think. I think in two thousand twenty one, it always happened on Saturday. It's always happened on on Saturday on two thousand twenty one. So it might happen on Saturday again. It might. It might happen on Saturday again. So we'll see. Ah. People are getting killed here. I, I gotta stay in the altar, guys. I gotta stay in the altar for the for the honor. I wanna I wanna go for the top honor rankings for the KVK. So I gotta get as many honor points as I can. Uh, I also have to uh, put on a, like a marker. Need to put like a, on like a marker here. Uh, one day, four hours. So I, I gotta set like an alarm here. One day, four hour from now is what time is this right now? It's 8 a.m. my time so it's like a 12 12 a.m. tomorrow 12 a.m. tomorrow gotta send my margins here at 12 a.m. tomorrow uh, where is the altar send to altar here uh, 11 a.m. Monday yep let's go to the altar tomorrow Monday Ancient Ruin. Here we go. We got some player here. Got some player here. Not much fighting going on today, guys. Ah. Uh... Did I manage to get like 15 million kills yet or no? I don't think I get a lot today. 14.6. 14.6 here. I need 15 million more kills. At least. At least 15 million more kills. Hopefully I'll get it. When the level 7 get open. Hopefully. Uh, show action point. My action point, like my uh, potion. Here, uh, I have around eight hundred thousand. Eight hundred thousand action points left. I can use eight hundred thousand that I can use for this KVK. So that I can gain more crystal. I gain more crystal. I gain more speed up. I gain more resources that I can use for Zenith of Power event. So I definitely want to use them all before, right before Zenith of Power event happens. So we'll see. 
But we'll see. It's gonna depend on when Zenith Pell event happens and when the level seven get open as well, right? So I want to use all of my action points before the level seven get open or before the Zenith Pell event happens. Um, I can I can definitely use speed up and resource it from killing Barbarian in this KVK for sure. So hit a thousand action point can definitely give me quite a lot of speed up and uh, quite a lot of resource it as well. So hopefully I can get some more gold from it. Hopefully. Uh, can you show us the overall stat of uh, my KVK? Uh, you can look at the... You can use the, the, the command. You can use the command in the chat. It, it gave you my uh, my update. Uh, for my stat. For kill that so far. Uh, I think I updated it. I think. Let me check here. If I, if I updated it yet or no. Uh... Try here. T four kill. Let me check on my T four kill here. Let me update my T four kill here. Oh, I haven't updated my T four kill. One ninety two. Or two. Defy kill is seventy eight. Oh, I got a lot, a lot of defy kill. Seventy eight to three seven, and that is what. Uh, one one eight three two. It. Okay. So I, I just updated my KVK stats again. Uh, you can use you can use the KVK stats commands to uh, to check my uh, my stats so far. Uh, it should update it now. Seven thousand action point, yeah. Bye bye, notice me, Senpai. <laughs> Sparkle, I always notice you. I'm sorry. Uh, how how's your KVK going? What what is your KVK against? Uh, Sparkle, let me check your KVK a little bit. Let me see. Tell me, tell me your KVK number here. We gotta go and check it out a little bit. Let's go and check out your KVK a little bit. Come on. Ooh, big player. 39-1 We got a big player from 39-1 right there Big big player Two two three nine. Alright let's check let's check on let, let's check on Sparkle KVK here A Sparkle Gang Spang Sparkle gang spang in his KVK right now. Choo choo three nine. Uh, which kingdom are you again? Choo choo three nine or what? You said you're in zone four, right? You got wrecked. You got pushed back to your zone four. <laughs> uh, which kingdom are you? Where are you? Who is here? Uh, 486, they got, uh, they got civil war, right? 486 got civil war here. Uh, look like allies here. Look like they are allies here. Uh, where are you? Are you Jialo Kingdoms? Are you 2239? Oh, shit. 2239 gang wreck. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Are you? Are you trying to turn it? Which, king, which kingdom are you? Which kingdom are you, Sparkle? Jello! You're not even doing a 1v2! Can you even do 1v1? I don't see... I do not see the other kingdom here. It's just pink... It's just orange here. It's just like orange here. 
And you have your allies here. You you guys you guys tried to, to do two v one and, and lost. Is that it? Is that you you try to do two v one and you lose, right? It's not one v two. It's not that you you guys trying to do one v two. You you guys try to do a two v one and you lose against Orange. Oh shit! That is bad. That is bad. <laughs> uh, are you happy with your kingdom, Sparkles? I told you not to migrate back to KVK2, man. Like, if you are, if you in Hero Hero Anthem KVK, you, you could have got something, right? Like, if you in uh, if you are in Hero Anthem KVK, you could have got something from the shop at least. Now you getting locked up. <laughs> you getting locked up again, right? If you in Season of Conquest, you can be, you can get the legendary commander sculpture. You can get the Mato Choi chest. I mean like you have uh, so many items you can buy. Guarantee. 100% guarantee. You just have to do the crystal research. You know? Even free to play player can get pre decent amount of crystal. Uh, decent amount of coins at the end of the day. Right? Why? Why are you going back to KVK Season 2 again man? Why? 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 Why Sparkle? Why? Going back to Season 2 again to get locked up. Man, you wasting, you wasting your passports. <laughs> you wasting your passport again. Uh, uh, the Korean forty four beats us. No, which one? The Korean? Which one? Which color is that? Why, why didn't you try to go against 88, 55? It's 44! 44 beat you guys? Why? Why don't you go to the left side with your allies? Isn't 46 your allies? Like why, do, why don't you why don't you do like a 2v1 against uh, 55? Like I don't I do I don't I do not understand. I don't understand why you doing a 1v2 like why are you not doing like a 2v1 against 88 and 55 here why <laughs> like your ally is on the other side right 22 46 is your allies or not wait 22 46 is your allies here and you are you you guys are not trying to lock up on 55. You go to the right side. What is the logic? What is the logic behind that? Please tell me. Please explain to me. Please explain to me why your kingdom decide to not go to the left side. Is is it because orange is much stronger than the other one? Right now you're getting locked up for no reason here. What the heck? I got for a passport for free when I spent three to migrate. Uh, I am good on passport and I have a proc daggers. Okay, okay. <laughs> Uh, we tried to do 2 versus 1 against 44. Uh, 53 and 39 against 44, but they beat us. 53. Oh, so 53 is. Oh, they got. They, 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 didn't, they did not get locked up yet. Oh. So your allies are here. Oh, your allies haven't, haven't got locked up yet. I see, I see. Okay, it makes sense. Uh, I thought they, I thought they are allies here because I do, I do not see them, uh, I do not see them getting uh, locked up here. You know what happened? You guys gotta fight together, right? You gotta build, you gotta build your fort here, and you gotta hold the gate together here together, okay? Right? Uh, you don't wanna, you don't wanna fight alone here, right? You wanna, you wanna build, okay? So, so, this, so this is a good plan right here. You got your, you got your NSG two alliance here. Right? Was it like a farm alliance? Uh, you gotta bring some bigger lands here. 
And you gotta fight together with 53, right? Fighting together gonna help you stronger, right? Uh, I, I would definitely... I would definitely dropping some fort here, right? Uh, dropping some fort here and uh, build like a defense lineup for the two kingdom, right? Uh, the two kingdom gotta do like a defense lineup together here and they got, you gotta push together, right? You gotta fight together at the same time and not like one at, one at a time here, right? What I'm what am I seeing right now is that like uh, you guys are fighting one at a time here, right? Uh, you are fighting 44 by yourself, and then uh, 53 fighting 44 by themselves here, right? That is not good, right? I think you guys need to regroup. I think you guys need to regroup here, right? Build, let's say build like a fort like a fort line up here, right? Build like a fort line up here, and uh, start pushing down all, all at the same time, right? Pushing down together here. I think you can win. Come on. 2v1, you can beat them. Wait. Uh it better. It better for you guys to avoid doing like a 1v1, 1v1 situation. You gotta try to do 2v1 2v1 here. Right. Like it it does looks to me that it does look to me that 53, right? 53 they they're avoiding, right? 44 they avoid 53 from the beginning and they focus on you guys, you guys right? Uh, 44 they focus on your kingdom which is 39 here right and then after they push you guys back they are pushing back on 53 here right so they are doing 1v1 1v1 here not like a 2v1 right uh you want you want to force them to do like a 2v1 right okay uh tell your kingdom leadership here right build fort here together with 53 and and gotta push together we right? gotta fight together here right don't fight alone don't fight alone here okay good luck Good luck in your KBK. You gotta, you gotta need it. Four minutes, guys. Four minutes for the altar to be finished. Watch out. Oh, they're blocking us here. They're blocking us from returning home here. Damn, these guys. Good thing I didn't return my marches here. Well, at least 1 is they are still fighting. Right, they got some fire there. They got some fire there, but not a lot of fire. Not a lot. A uh, batch in quest here. Advance iron ore. Oh, come on. No donating. No donating uh, materials for me. I need them. So no donation for materials. No donation for resources for me. For the batch in quest. I want kill barbarians. I want kill forts. I want uh, deal. I want donate uh, animal bones. I can do those quests. Uh, I cannot do troop training. Well, I am very limited right now. I am very very limited right now in terms of like what batch in quest I can do because I have I cannot do a lot. Uh, so we'll see here. How many more days for my troop training to finish here? 13 days, okay. 13 days for troop training to finish. All right, guys. I think there's not much fighting anymore. Um, let's uh let's check out later. Right, I'm gonna end the stream now. But uh, I'll be if if Drago Ten. I think Drago Ten is there because streaming hits a uh, level seven get opening very soon. I mean Kingsland opening. Like I would love to see. I would love to see uh 1307 fighting in Kingsland, right? So let let me rest a little bit here. I woke up a little bit early today. So 
uh kingsland kingsland open for 37 in four hours guys so uh be there okay let 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 let's check out some of the other people streaming later i think dragon 10 will most likely going to stream it because it's like a big day for them so he will most likely going to stream it so i'll see you guys there okay uh, i'll see you guys at dragon 10 live stream later when kingsland open for his uh, kingdom his kvk but uh unfortunately we do not have a lot of fighting today uh we try to get uh we try to we try to do what we can but um uh we can't do much when uh, 1601 doesn't doesn't want to fire us here right, they have uh, some fire right, they have some fire but not enough not enough to uh to 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 do anything to us today right we we just completely wipe them out every time uh it was too one-sided today right too too one-sided today uh it's not even fun it's not even fun for a lot of us here especially a lot for me i had to woke up very very early today and it's, it is definitely not worth it there uh, we'll see maybe they gotta do better when uh, when they are together with 1534 right we'll, we'll definitely see a better turnout hopefully hopefully guys uh until next time uh you guys can definitely come back here again at 20 utc for my arc of osiris match as well i'll be playing arc and i'll be streaming it as well uh, so see you guys there, right? See you guys at 20 UTC, you guys. Take care and have a, a good day.